Hello, hello, it's Shara. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do my makeup using only Maybelline products. Before we start, don't forget to subscribe, turn on my post notifications so you get notified whenever I upload. Lately, I have been feeling like my skin is getting rough. I just feel like my face is not in the good condition. I feel like this part is getting rough. I thought it was just a season changing thing and I watched some YouTube videos and people were saying like when you're 25, that's like the first downhill that you would notice like your body is changing and stuff like that. And apparently it's a thing at age of 25. I don't know, everyone's just saying like you will notice a difference. Even my mom knows, I was telling her yesterday and she was like, yeah, you've never heard of that? I'm like, no. <laughs> it's just crazy that I notice a difference and then apparently it's a thing that everyone knows. So I'm a little scared right now, but trying to stay positive, as my mom says, positive vibes. Let's just get started. I already apply moisturizer on my face. To start off, I'm going to use concealer. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. I usually mix the two shades. That's number 20, and this is number 15. I like to mix the two. Like, Maybelline is such a good drugstore brand as a little girl. I always remember their commercial. That's in Taiwan. So Maybelline has been around forever. Their commercial, like at the end, they would always say, maybe it's Maybelline. Does anyone remember that? Or... And their commercial always look fabulous. Even in Taiwan, Maybelline is big. I'm going to put one more layer on my nose right here. Over here has the redness lately dark spot right here i'm not sure if that's my birthmark i'm not sure if that has always been there i discovered a uh, several years ago and i was pretty surprised i don't know if i just didn't notice for my entire life or i don't know I'm not sure what that is but i do have a lot of sunspots so i i wouldn't be surprised if that's part of it but it's huge now i'm going in with maybelline's fit me loose finishing powder I'm just gonna dust this slightly underneath my eye, my forehead, most importantly on my smile line. I feel like my smile line is so obvious now, but I don't know if that's because of my age. Obviously, that's one of the factors, but another thing is that I have been wearing Invisalign, and when you wear it, like braces, it makes your lips pop more like more out that kind of makes it like imagine your lips are out more and i don't know it's just make those lines even more obvious we don't need a lot of powder pixie are you waiting for nai nai she's waiting for her nai nai so cute let me show you she's waiting in front of my mom's door she's here right now hi baby pixie want to say hi Burshi burshi. Now I'm going to do my eyebrows with Maybelline's Brow Ultra Slim. This is in the color Soft Brown. Let's try this out. And brush my brows. Pretty easy to apply. I haven't tried out any other brow pencil in a while ever since I started to use Benefits Goof Proof Brow Pencil. Oh my gosh, I got that right. <laughs> I can't really talk when I'm doing my eyebrows. My eyebrows are on. Remember, they're sisters and not twins. Don't give yourself a hard time. Eyeshadow is fun because it's colorful. For eyeshadow, I'm using Maybelline's Lemonade Craze. This is such a perfect eyeshadow palette for spring and summer. I'm going to use this one right here for my base oh it's very powdery i always like to have a white canvas to start off so that's what it's for it's kind of like the same color as my skin tone sunnies i'm gonna try this one to see if it's a better white okay yeah this is white just all over my lid 
and my brow bone. I need to cheat a little bit because I don't have Maybelline setting spray, but I'm gonna use Milani's setting spray. It's still a drugstore brand. I'm going to spray my setting spray on the brush. I'm going to use this color Sugar Coated. This is a um, shimmery color. Just pack this onto my lid. It's messy, but it's okay. Okay, so like that, I know what you're thinking. It looks crazy right now, but don't you worry. I'm going to blend this out with sweet tea. Isn't it better now? I'm going into this dark chocolate color. I'm just going to put this right here at the end of my crease right here to add more definition going back to sweet tea going in with the champagne color citrus two-third of my waterline this is how it looks like so far I'm going to use strawberry lemonade Apply it onto my inner corner, right here. Is it shiny enough? Also, in the middle of my waterline, right here. This is how it looks like. Use this dark chocolate color again. Use this color as my inner liner. And drag it out a little now I got some eyeliner now I'm going to use Maybelline's fit me bronzer Do you see a difference with the nose contour? Because I do. It's so different. Now I'm going to use Maybelline's Fit Me Blush. This is in the color number 15. Do you see a pattern here? I love the Fit Me line. I love this blush. It's very subtle. After I apply the bronzer and blush, I like to use the sponge and just like gently go over it to blur out the harsh lines. I'm going to use Maybelline's Master Chrome by Face Studio Metallic Highlighter. This is in the color Molten Gold. Ooh, shiny. This is a good highlighter. I like it. See how shiny that is? Wow. This highlighter is beautiful. This highlighter looks high-end. I am impressed. Let me spray the setting spray first. Milani's setting spray is pretty good, but it doesn't taste good. I usually use Makeup Forever's um, Fix and Mist, and it doesn't taste that bad. Like, I wouldn't feel like I taste the product, but whenever I'm using Milani's, I can taste it for some reason. I'm going to curl my lashes. I'm going to use their Volume Express, the Colossal Mascara. This is in the color Glam Brown.
last but not least, this is Maybelline's lipstick in the color Spice For Me. I'm just gonna tap it on because this color is pretty deep. I like the color. That is it for this look. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like this full face Maybelline look. If you do, please don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on my post notifications, and follow me on Instagram. Thanks for watching. Bye!